Chavigan and today we have uh, with us Nikhil Goyal. He is truly an amazing entrepreneur and have a great experience in the blockchain industry. It's been years that he has been contributed to these Web3 communities and the companies and uh, he is uh, currently um, having the position of co-founder at Beyond Imagination Technologies and at the same time he is a CEO at SA Watercrafts Private Limited. So thank you so much sir for coming in and we'd love to know about you. Thank you. Uh, thank you so much for having me. It's it's a pleasure. It's a request which I make to everybody in my company as well. Um, let's, let's just call me Nikhil. I, I, I don't like the word sir. Uh, 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 it's a rule actually in my company. So from an intern to the CTO, everybody is addressed by the name. Uh, we feel that we should actually evolve into a company where everybody has the liberty to speak. I love what Pratan Tata or, or the Tata group says. We should have the liberty to make mistakes, but speak up. So, yeah, thank you so much for having me. Uh, um, I think blockchain Web3 is a very hot world today. I've learned a lot from, from multiple friends, advisors, uh, uh, stalwarts of the industry. Actually, a dear friend of mine is 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 the reason why I started this company. Uh, uh, he's 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 going to be a great uh, blockchain entrepreneur uh, uh, around the world. Uh, um, <coughs> so yes, thank you so much for having me. And and there is so much so much to talk about uh, uh, in this world. Yes, I'm super excited. I'm also very much excited for this because Web3 is something that's going to boom in the future and uh, we are here to talk about it today. So, uh, like uh, moving further, uh, I just wanted to understand that according to you, what's Web3 in India? Like how was your experience and how you actually got started with this company? So, I'll be very honest with you. Um, um, most of the world, not only India, the most of the world thinks that blockchain, crypto and Bitcoin is, is actually the same thing, but different people use different words to explain the same. And very truly, even I used to feel or, or understand the same. That's, that's when I realized that blockchain is a technology or a language or, 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 a, or, or a platform like maybe a C++, Fox Pro, many other, many other, you know, uh, technologies and languages crypto is one of the solutions that sits on blockchain and and bitcoin is 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 a product that is that is the the result of of crypto so so that narrative is very very important um, blockchain and crypto is is not uh, parallel it's it's blockchain is the technology crypto is a solution that comes on blockchain and Bitcoin is a product. So let's start with that. So number one, number two, I think the kind of uh, you, you specifically asked me what's Web3 in India. I believe it is, it is, it is, it is probably the largest market that needs blockchain technology. So uh, uh, a lot of stuff is happening in India. It's very exciting. There's a lot of real world problems that are being solved by the Indian entrepreneurs, corporates, government. There's a lot of stuff happening around the use of blockchain for maybe the financial sector. Just a couple of days back, the RBI has actually asked banks to look at how blockchain can make their lives easier. There is land registries happening on, on blockchain. There is, there is a record management that is happening on blockchain. There is uh, Estonia as a country runs on blockchain. So you can imagine the kind of e-governance that, that can actually uh, uh, be done in India. Uh, yeah, that's true. Dubai as a smart city saves the cost of one Burj Khalifa every year by using blockchain because they 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 uh, diminish or or um, you know they save that many man hours they they increase productivity uh, and many other things which helps them even save cost and time so so 
So the kind of usage that can happen in blockchain for India is massive. It's about us as, as entrepreneurs and us as citizens of the country warming up to the idea and taking it in the right manner. Which, which probably will happen with time, Chavi. It's, it's, you know, you cannot, you cannot push. But if the technology is right, I don't see it uh, not being adopted. That's truly, uh, like, um, I, I totally agree with all these things. So, like, um, you, uh, like, it's been years that you have been into this industry and you have been contributing to it. So. Uh, what was your thought process like was there something that you thought yeah this is something that I think this is lacking so let's get started with the company let's have a bunch of people so what was the thought process of yours when you got started with this okay so I would like to clarify one thing because because it's a recorded uh, conversation we haven't been uh, years into this uh, uh, for years I've known blockchain I never wanted to get into blockchain because there was always an aspect that we are playing with speculation of cryptocurrency. But when I actually found the real world need for blockchain is when I actually entered into this space. So uh, we don't do crypto and NFT and, and, and speculation. We like to use the technology for, uh, for solving real world problems. Number one. Number two, I will always credit this. Uh, this venture of mine to a dear friend who actually is bringing up uh, one of the best blockchain platforms around the world. Uh, he asked me to help him sort of move around the country and, and, and see if there is good adoption possible in India. And, and believe me when I say this, people who I met had more knowledge than me on blockchain. And they, 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 they knew what they wanted and they knew how blockchain can solve their problems. They just didn't have the capability to transfer it into a solution. That's that was very, very, very exciting. And that's when I went back to him saying, uh, let's let's do something. And, and, and <clears throat> I totally understand that building a blockchain platform is, is probably a larger business needs more focus and, and all the resources you can get is, is important to do that. That's when Beyond Imagination Technologies was born. We call ourselves as the chefs of the blockchain world, where we make solutions that are consumable by the end client or by the real user. So uh, imagine you going to a restaurant and, and having a, a, a kacha a, a, a carrot and, 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 and you know, uh, onions and, and maybe the the real dal ke kuch particle you know dal ke wo, uh, the, the dana on your plate that's that's not how you can consume it. you need a chef who can actually cook it and, and present it and, and and make it consumable so it's, yeah so that's what my company does we we interact with people we understand the problems we 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 go uh, into a little depth as to where they stand what are the pain points and we try and uh, uh, transition a few systems and processes using the world of blockchain and Web3 to, to actually solve their pain points or, or, or advance them into, into the new technology. So that's, that's like a transition. So that is something that we do, which we call a digital transformation for, for, for these corporates and, and organizations. We also have, we also have uh, a, a loyalty program that we've actually a loyalty program solution that we've deployed with Cafe Coffee Day, which is um, which is probably one of the largest brands in India, or if nothing, that was the first homegrown large brand that we all were proud of back in the day. We we take a lot of pride in this deployment. We we have a digital transformation signed with the Indian Army. We we doing some activities with Indian Railways. So yeah, uh, uh, and as we are learning about problems, we are coming out with solutions. Uh, on the 14th, we'll be unveiling our uh, education solutions uh, uh, to in front of 100, 200 uh, eminent 
uh, people from the education sector. We've, you know, I'm sure you must have gone through it. I've gone through it. We've carried our, our file of certificates all, all our lives. A few times, a few of our mark sheets were found under the mattress because our mom kept it there. She thought that was the safest place in the house. A few of our certificates are actually below the newspaper in your Almira. A few of the certificates have got lost in the floods. Few of them have got burnt. Few of them you forgot in the cafe because you were chilling with your friends and, and you forgot to pick up your file. We want to bring all of that uh, on blockchain. One. Two, why should a student be judged only by his mark sheet? Why should he not be judged by the extracurricular activities, sports, social service, music, elocution, debate, quiz? So that's that's what we are trying to bring forward in, in the form of a solution where we would want to capture uh, the digital credentials, the credentials in a digital manner for every student from his birth certificate to, 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 to going forward. We believe that internationally there are a lot of points that are given more than the mark sheet. We believe that even for employment, there is a lot more focus given on the personality of the person than only his mark sheet. This is our way of sort of bringing it out. Uh, another thing that we've we've sort of done is is for the education sector something that we've already started. Uh, we call it the Web Three Club. We want to empower the kids with the knowledge of blockchain and Web Three. We want them to believe that this can be a career path. We don't want them to know or understand or 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 be be uh, disillusioned that only a tech guy can be associated with Web3. So uh, we, we we conduct masterclasses. I, 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 I ask my friends to sort of come and, and give give half an hour, one hour. Uh, I wouldn't call it classes. It's more like an interaction um, about metaverse, gamification, blockchain, Web3, the potential of a person to take this up as a career, be it development, be it facilitation, be it an entrepreneur, the scope that there is, the, 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 the world is hungry for talent in the Web3 world. So, you know, it's, it's very important. I wish in the 1990s or maybe in the 2000s, uh, you know, such exercises were done for, for, for us to believe that internet was, was the next big thing. And then see, I mean, did you, did you even imagine in your, I mean, did you even imagine that you can follow a car and Uber from where it is to your house on, on an app? No, none of us did, but it's happening. Exactly. That's true. So imagine the kind of things that Web3 and blockchain will bring to you. And if people can get associated with it, I think employment today is a very big factor. And as the nation, as India develops, I would like to contribute by bringing in more skilled labor. And it's just a terminology labor, but it's actually people who are who are who are who are getting tons of money on a monthly basis. So you know, uh, uh, quality quality citizens of the country is probably what we want to. We believe we can build through the help of blockchain and Web three clubs. So we we making a little effort in that as well, it's trying to make a community around kids and 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 and, and people who who would love to be, who are intrigued about this this revolution. Exactly. So yeah, so three things we are doing, which is exciting, which is doing it a lot of out of passion, uh, and doing a lot of stuff out of out of the need that we feel there is in the market, the gaps that there are loving the journey enjoying the journey that's truly amazing i i, I actually love it right? so uh like um would i uh, love to know for the last thing that um what 
uh, like according to you, what would be the future of Web3 and uh, what would be that one advice you want to give to the students and at the same time the professionals who want to get started with Web3 and they have a lot of dilemmas in their minds. So what would be that thing that you want to say? I wish I was an expert. I don't believe anybody is an expert in Web3 because it is still an evolving technology and people are still learning about it on a daily basis. Anybody who calls himself an expert just shut the door because the world hasn't really seen the full potential of Web3 and blockchain yet. Number one. Number two, join the Web3 club. You'll learn a lot. <laughs> uh, uh, honestly, uh, um, I believe uh, everybody should look at it in a very serious manner. Don't only look at it from being a part of it. Maybe if you're a businessman, it can facilitate or act as a catalyst to your business. I'm, I'm, I'm not saying be a part of that, you know, do Web3. You know, today in Metaverse, there are people who are managing McDonald's and subways and that's a job Ooh, i mean I, I i didn't believe it <laughs> you know so 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 what i'm trying to say is it's it's a world of opportunity it's a parallel world coming out there are real world problems there are metaverses gamification even the government is looking at how they can gamify uh, uh, stuff that they feel is difficult to convey to the world and and put it across in a game game manner and, and it'll be easier for it'll be easier for uh, you and I to understand. So you know, use this. Please understand. As the nation is developing, uh, we will go from a manufacturing to a service kind of an economy, or at least uh, there's a lot of shift that will happen. Blockchain and Web three is 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 hot. It's here to stay. It's the next decade. It will live here. Try and understand at least what it is. Let's start with that. There are a lot of misconceptions that it is parallel to crypto or Bitcoin. It is not. Understand that. Once we start understanding that, even a designer can use Web3. I'm not saying the designer has to be a part of the Web3, uh, you know, of the Web3 world. But they should understand or try and relate to how they can use Web3 to catapult their business. You know, there is so much royalty issues today, which can be solved by Web3. There are so many such, I mean, earlier there were servers, we've had floppy disks, then we had CD-ROMs, then we had servers. Now everything goes on cloud. Tomorrow everything will go on blockchain. Record keeping itself, data itself is such a large uh, aspect. So all, all, all I can say is, is at least understand what it is. You be a developer, you be a facilitator, you be an entrepreneur. You use this technology for the growth of your current company. I don't believe there is any company in this world today, which does not use a laptop or a desktop or an email address or a website. So we are already in that, in that, in that phase where we are using computers. So I, all I'm saying is try and understand how it can help. And then there are so many opportunities for you to sort of clamp down upon. And believe me, when I say this, suddenly the world has come down back. It's an equalizer web three. So, so, so a 21 year old who has just come out of college is standing at the same level that a 50 year old company is standing at. It's quite an equalizer. Use this opportunity to, 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 to do fantastic things. So, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm very bullish. I, I'm, I'm very confident. Uh, I, I love the space and, and I believe these, uh, 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 the younger guys, they can they can really make careers out of it. and 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 i also believe that america used to make products for for the world it's india's turn to make products for the world now
that's uh, that's so true and uh, thank you so much um Nikhil for coming in and joining in it was truly an amazing uh, podcast recording with you because uh, it was such a real conversation that we had today it was truly amazing so thank you so much for coming in and thank you so much for everyone joining and we'll see you again in the next podcast see you then see ya bye bye pleasure thank you so much and 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 Let's all get connected to Web three and blockchain. Exactly. <laughs> yes. Pleasure. Thank you so much. Okay, bye bye. Bye bye.